So here's a little bit of a specialty in the Hearthstone dungeon run. We are facing Tad, and this is gonna be a bit of a special video. This is not uh, related to our dungeon run series. We are going to teach you, or show you the tutorial of, uh, how to play Tad the right way, because there is a... Is it an Easter egg? Kinda, sorta? Well, in a way, yeah. So basically, the idea is to not hurt Tad till he draws his final card, at which point we get a treasure and we can auto win the thing. Doomsayer is really good. Doomsayer is pretty good. Also keep Meteor, I'd say. Ice Bear is of no use. Well, Ice Bear, we don't need to kill his minions, we can just right. stay alive. So Ice Bear isn't it's bad. It's okay. So the, uh, basically the strategy against Tad is gonna be to take all of his minions out and not let him get any damage to his face. Uh, there is one card that he's gonna draw himself, or recruit himself rather, that we're gonna need to take out. Because it will deal damage to his own face. So we don't want that, so I guess just Raven now. I think it might actually already be the next one as well. It the might be. Start my crowd. No, it's no, Mill House. It's, oh, right, it's, it's three. Okay, so I guess we can kill the Mill House real quick. Uh, but forgot Torch? Yeah. yeah. You can also Frostbolt the Hive Queen, but that's not necessary right now. No, let's not do that, let's... Yeah. So basically, just clean up boards, don't die, that's there the one. So that this we need one to is really dangerous, because yes. it damages him at the start of his turn, meaning we need to take it out. Conveniently for us, we a mage. we're a mage, so that's not a problem. It doesn't matter, we're... Am I not gonna Doomsayer just now? No, it's no Doomsayer will keep it for later. For when he pulls, pulls a Tyrantus, because that's the toughest one for us to deal with. Right, yeah. Oh, 4 mana 7-7. Seven, seven. Hey. <laughs> oh, I'm one minute off of being able to conveniently kill him with a portal, but you can but meteor. I can meteor take out his entire board. Again, once you get to turn 11, you automatically win, so you don't have to worry about cleaning up the board then. Final portal, I believe, perfectly works. Yep, because our spells uh, do more damage too, right? That's, uh, yeah, that's the role with the yeah. Magi. Crazy Worshipper. Crazy Worshipper is good as a taunt. Yeah. There's a Karen Bloodhoof. In that case, actually, the increased damage isn't that useful because if you we, if you freeze him, we just kill him. Yeah, I know. Well, just do it anyway. We're just gonna run to taunt. Just do it and run a taunt into him. Yeah. Put the yeti down, and we're good. You could have here powered him or, or meta worm, but whatever. There's a Swamp King Dread. Yeah, so he plays really big stuff, as best as he does. Roaring Torch is perfect, perfect for that, yeah. As is Fireball. It doesn't matter. That's, yeah, but it was... Maybe Fireball because it costs him more. Yeah, but I was going to play the Mana first. Yeah. And enter. Right, I forgot about that one. My bad. What? It killed the Mana one because of Swamp King Dread. Oh. Uh, oh. Okay. That's what he does. Obviously, yeah. And there's a Reggie. <laughs> At least I can't hit Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, torch that. Maybe bag of stuffing. Yeah, sure. Archivist. Well, a bunch of stuff, but we. I don't think we need to do anything. You can play an ice barrier. Yeah, I wanted to play one thing. And so... far seer your face. Oops, not that one. Don't, uh, don't so, pyroblast the guy. So yeah, I was gonna yeah. play at least one card from my hand so that I wouldn't burn a card, but yeah. So there's this crush. We're just gonna. Alright, so I'm gonna run into face. This is where we play the Doomsayer for sure. Okay. And this is where we kill the guy. Uh, or, or we, yeah, we freeze him at worst. Blizzard. Because the next turn is Tarantus. Okay, then Doomsayer. Yep. Although, it doesn't matter because now he pushes Tarantus and the turn afterwards, he's gonna pull the chest. Yeah. Which we then can kill, but. Which we can kill cool. after Just the turn. And now. And now he's gonna pull the chest, right? Yeah. From out of nowhere. And there we go. So this chest, look at the favorite text real quick. This is gonna add his fishing pole to our hand, and it's gonna win us the game immediately. So we're just gonna the ping deck, that but yeah. to, the, to the deck, I'm sorry, yeah. And we're gonna keep that for later. Which, so you saw it briefly there, but I'm gonna show it again yeah. once we get to this deck screen. We can also play the next game if you wanna. Just finish the run. We wanted to beat it with Mage anyway. Uh, let's do it in another video because uh, with, the, with the boss, because this is a specialized video. Okay. Right? Don't wanna make this too long. Yeah, okay, it makes sense. Pick one. Uh, wait, yeah. 
So show the um The point was the, the tadpole. tadpole. So at the end of the turn, summon a minion from your opponent's deck, which means I'm assuming that we are getting the minion from his deck. Yes, exactly. Which is insane. This is really good. Really powerful. Play that against the darkness or anyone else for that matter. Tough. So the last two uh, are going to be in a regular video again that we're going to release on some type of day, probably a Sunday, for um, to hopefully finish off the Mage Dungeon run, which we haven't done yet. Fell a bunch of times. But that's how you do the Ted thing correctly, because that could give you a huge push on winning the, the run that you're on. So if you're lucky enough to get Ted, now you know how to do it. Yeah. Right? So thank you for watching. Let us know what you think about the video. Subscribe not to miss more stuff and show some appreciation for this tutorial. We're going to see you next time, JJ. That's it? That's it.